According to one study, a human being has on an average of about 60,000 thoughts every day. Most of these thoughts that pass through the mind are unstructured, random, and largely incoherent. We start thinking about something only to notice that our mind has shifted to some other subject, which is probably not relevant to the earlier one. Thoughts take us away from the moment. For instance, when we are driving or thinking about something interesting, and absorbing, we are completely unaware of the surrounding world. The mind becomes unaware of time because we lose track of time. We are disassociated from many ongoing sensations of the body from an external environment. The world simply disappears for us during those very moments. All conceivable thoughts that can potentially appear in our mind arise in the consciousness and when the wave of any thought is collapsed by consciousness, then that particular thought arises in the mind. This phenomenon is called actuality in quantum mechanics. Hence mind is a perpetual event in which thoughts appear and disappear in an infinite progression. Because of this phenomenon, the mind engages us in a continuous stream of thoughts. Now the pertinent question arises as to how and where do all these thoughts come from. This is a highly perplexing question that neuroscientists have been struggling since long to answer it. With new brain imaging techniques, researchers are making inroads in their understanding of how thoughts appear in the brain. The human brain is comprised of nearly 90 to 100 billion neurons and we can say specialized cells, these neurons. These are interconnected by billions and trillions of synaptic connections, each transmitting signals. Some specialized connections send up to 1000 signals per second. Basically, these thoughts arise as electrochemical responses from neurons. According to Charles Jennings, Director of Neurotechnology Program at MIT's McGovern Institute for Brain Research, thoughts are produced from these electrochemical reactions. All external stimuli received through any sense organs such as skin, eye, nose, it triggers a series of signals in the brain. Within a few milliseconds, the signal reaches billions of neurons in many interconnected areas or regions of the brain. Given the extreme complexity of what is happening within the brain, it is not easy to trace a thought from beginning to end. On the average, each synaptic connection between neurons transmit about one signal per second. And somehow that is producing thought. In some mysterious way, trillions of connections and billions of simultaneous transmissions coalesce inside our brain to form a thought. Scientists have still a long way to go before they clearly understand how exactly thoughts are generated in our brain. Hopefully the way the neurosciences are progressing, we will have a clear picture of this intricate process of generating thoughts in our brain. Thanks for watching this video.